Definitely there is a big escalation in the region. In fact, we are all concerned about the Iran-Israel escalation and the threat coming from each side. Saudi Arabia position has been very clear that they will not allow the usage of their aerospace. First and second, of course, they are of, you know, uh, stopping the war and uh, reaching some sort of uh, political agreement. And third, Saudi have always been against any violent non-state actor group. They've never supported neither Hamas or Hezbollah or the Hashd al-Shaab in Iraq. They always wanted to see a strong central government role because if there is a weak central government role, that will be the platform where the violent non-state actors, they grow in it. Well, my perception in the Saudi position, I believe Saudi, they wanted to see peace and security in the region. They would like to see resolving the problem by all means. Saudi is very concerned about the escalation from Iran or from Israel. Also, the Saudi have demanded and have created the biggest and called for the, the biggest international gathering to recognize Palestine as a full member of the United Nations. That was in New York in the end of uh, September. But also Saudi Arabia, they were very clear uh, on the uh, annual speech of the king, which was delivered by the Crown Prince of Saudi Arabia on 18th of September, uh, which says that there will be no normalization with Israel without having a Palestinian state.